Getting started with Go Anywhere MFT on Microsoft Azure is an easy process that only takes a few minutes to get up and running. To get started, navigate to the Azure Marketplace at azuremarketplace.microsoft.com and search for Go Anywhere MFT. The search suggestions will show two entries, one for Linux and one for Windows. I'm going to pick Windows, but the rest of the instructions and tutorial will be applicable for both. Go Anywhere uses the Bring Your Own License model, which means you will be able to launch and configure Go Anywhere from Azure, but you won't be able to start any services or run any project workflows until you have a license. To register for a free 30-day trial license, go to the customer portal at my.goanywhere.com. If you are an existing customer planning to move to Azure, you can request a new temporary license directly through the portal. Registering for the customer portal is essential. The documentation area of the portal provides you with the installation instructions, which includes the default username and password used to log into Go Anywhere. The install instructions also include the default port numbers for the administrator and file transfer services. Let's get back to installing Go Anywhere from the Azure Marketplace. Click the Get It Now button. Click Continue you will be prompted to log into your Microsoft Azure account. Click the Create button. You will be prompted to create the virtual machine where Go Anywhere will be installed. Complete the fields based on your Azure subscription and resource model, and then click OK. You will then be presented with the virtual machine options. For demonstration purposes, I'll select a server size that meets the minimum installation requirements. If you expect a lot of transfers and heavy usage, you'll want to pick a larger size. Next, the optional high availability and network features for the VM are displayed. These should be configured for your network requirements and business needs. Microsoft provides additional information for each of these options. I will leave the default settings and click OK. Azure will review the settings and provide a summary of the VM and software. Click Create. Azure will take a few minutes to deploy the server. Once the deployment is finished, your VM will appear on the Resources page. Log into your VM, open the default web browser, and then navigate to localhost port 8000. The Go Anywhere administrator will appear. Log in with the username and password found in the installation manual and then apply your license using the License page under the Help menu. The final step to get up and running through Azure is to configure the operating system's firewall, as well as the Azure VM firewall, to allow incoming connections to the desired services ports listed in the installation guide. Once these ports have been opened, you can use the public IP address found on the Azure resource page to remotely administrate Go Anywhere without needing to connect to the VM or through the Azure portal. And that's all it takes to get up and running with Go Anywhere MFT on Azure. For more information or to schedule a live demonstration, contact a sales representative using the contact information provided.